3.5 million people in the United States are on the autism spectrum. True. I would probably say true. True? True? True. Autism is the fastest growing developmental disorder in the United States. True. Uh, true. True? Autism spectrum disorder affects people of all races, ethnicities, and socioeconomic groups. True. I think true. True. Hello. My name is Christopher Banks. I am the president and CEO of the Autism Society of America. We understand the ongoing concerns surrounding the coronavirus. During this crisis, the Autism Society is communicating regularly with our staff and affiliates to provide relevant, reputable resources and information to address the added challenges for the autism community. Now more than ever, we need you to join us as we spread awareness, promote acceptance, and ignite change. You know, fortunately, there are some resources that have been coming out. You know, I know some people created social stories or some other things to try to sure. help, um, you know, and some other virtual um, tools as well to try to help uh, people to understand what's going on with COVID. I hope that uh, people are seen as being more equal and that people are seen as having inherent value and that we're not looking purely at the weaknesses, but the strengths and that it's okay to get help. I can do other things. Uh, <laughs> like I'm creative, I'm artistic. I have friends that I'm able to reach out to in my support network. So I think a way that we can start empowering ourselves is looking at what are we good at? What are our strengths? We all have our area of influence, the people who listen to us or who care about us. We can uh, find a way to kind of um, project and amplify the voices and the needs of others. You know, someone who is not, does not have autism can still talk about things related to autism that are important. Someone who's not a person of color can talk about the importance of equity and all of those things. And so, you know, being there, learning about each other, growing, asking questions, not being afraid to change. Things need to change. They, you know, they're changing, but they need to. I'd like to give a shout out to my non-speaking community. We are underrepresented and love to be I-N-C-L-U-D-E-D-I-N-T-H-E and love to be included yes. in the yes. conversation. Yes. Possibility is a word that I associate with myself. Possibility actually precedes opportunity. I also believe the purpose of human existence is to help others. So I think these will be guiding principles that drive whatever I end up doing. Thank you Autism Society of America for T-H-I-S-O-P-P-O-R-T-U-N-I-T-Y. And thank you for this Autism Society of America for this opportunity.